Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Center. I hope everybody's well. Um, in absolutely no particular order, we are going to do January round two. Hopefully I don't lose my place. I just want to make sure that all of the readings get posted, or as many of them as possible, before I start my second job which I haven't interviewed yet for, but I got two feelers out for Tuesday, so it's looking pretty good, guys. The Titanic's not sinking on my watch, I'll tell you that right now. All right. Libra. All right, so I'm not looking. They're in whatever order they're going to be in. This reading will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 2022, round two. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to whatever you choose to do. The message given by the cards, if you choose to do anything at all. It is your journey, not mine. It's throwing down cards. If it does not resonate, that is okay too. You can check your moon, rising, or Venus sign readings. If you think it might work, then it might resonate a little bit better. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. It might play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. This isn't going to be the typical round two. Mm -mm. Nope. Not the typical round two. I want to see anything I missed. Okay? We will do the all about you reading toward the end of the month. How about that? I'm liking where this is going. So, Oh, that hair freak came out. Three pentacles. All right. Ooh, I'm gonna have to dig my clarifier out of my box. It's okay. So I think the rider weight is in the other room. So we'll have to pause and go get it. I wasn't ready. I'm sorry. This is very spontaneous. It's like quarter after midnight on a Friday night. Just got done at the bread and butter job. Felt like reading cards. Why not? I'm wide awake. Let's just do this. One more. One more. The sad sun. We do spontaneous weird stuff every once in a while. Okay. La, la, la. Wow. This is you. I didn't tip down yet. This is them. I'm one card in for their energy. I don't think y'all even read not the same book. Okay? Just throwing that out there. Mm -hmm. King of Pentacles. Huh. <coughs> Alright, I'm going to run into the other room. Get, you know what? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm just going to clarify with whatever tickles my fancy today. Okay. Mm, this one. No, this one. Why leave the room? This is the Earth sign deck. You both got the High Priestess, or sorry, the High Priest or the Hierophant. So, what the hey? Okay, it's saying stop, so I'm just going to stop. Talk to me about the Hierophant for Libra. Talk to me about the Hierophant. Thank you. Tipping down so you guys can see. Queen of Cups reversed. Yay. Oh, yay. All right. One more, thanks. Dang!
why the emperor reversed. I'm going to shut up and throw the rest of the clarifiers down before I say another word. Sun. Oh my gosh, Libra. Out of control. Heavily burdened. Why the sun? They see potential for happiness, but... Mm, there's a burden that's there. There's still a sense of vulnerability. Why the Queen of Wands reversed for what they think of you? Why the Queen of Wands reversed? Oh, gosh. You're hung up on something. You're stuck. You're stuck to something else. You're jaded. You're angry. Something new can't start. You're stuck. You're bound. You're bound. Sorts of four ones reversed. You're heartbroken. Can't build something new. Unstable foundations. Why the Five of Pentacles for your intended actions toward them? Why the Five of Pentacles? High Priestess reversed. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Did you get a ghost? Are you thinking of ghosting? Why the hyper is just reversed? Oh my gosh, Ten of Swords reverse, Six of Cups reverse, World reverse. You're gonna ghost. What? Why the Seven of Pentacles? Seven of Pentacles reverse, Nine of Cups reversed. They don't fulfill you. They see potential in you. Or you see potential in them, but you're going to ghost. You see potential in them, but you're going to ghost. You're not... What? I see bad blood, I see unfinished cycles, I see you losing patience and leaving something hanging out there. See, Hierophant, Eight of Cups, Queen of Cups, Reverse. Somebody's not giving a cup. Somebody's not ready to give a cup, so you're going to move on. 
why the emperor's reversed. Ace of Wands. Starting something new somewhere else. Princess Swords. Lovers Reverse. Yeah. Just leaving this hanging out there, letting it disconnect because it's not going to grow. Talking to other people. Alright. High Priest Reversed on their side. Why the High Priest Reversed? They're not ready for... You are, but they're not. I think you're ready now, and if they're not ready, you're, well, you're going to walk. You're coming in as the Three of Pentacles. You want the steady foundation. Why the High Priest reversed? Five of Cups reversed. They have, they have unprocessed sadness. I'm leaving that alone. They aren't ready to commit because they have unprocessed sadness. Prince of Pentacles reversed. Stagnation. Why the Knight of Swords reversed for how they feel about you? Why the Knight of Swords reversed? Temperance. Keeping secrets, not saying stuff. Just trying to keep the flow going. Trying to keep the energy positive. Attempting to be patient. Strength reverse. Drained. Draining. Draining. Ace of Cups. There's that cup. There's that cup. There's that cup. The potential's there. I'm hearing. They find your positivity draining. Wow. Wow. Okay, why the moon? Why the moon for what they think of you? Why the moon? Whoa, card. Whoa, 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 whoa. Queen of Wands reversed, Hang Man reversed, Justice reversed. Five Pentacles reversed, King of Cups reversed. Now you're going to start marrying each other? There's things you don't say. Emotional closing off. Anger. Why the Five of Pentacles reversed? Emperor revert. Really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Now you start mirroring each other? Emotionally closed off. Vulnerable. Guarded. Angry. Hung up. Unstable. Why? King of Wands reversed. Two Swords reversed. Because it's not moving forward. They know you have a decision to make. They know you're chewing on it. They sense it. They know you're chewing on it. Alright, why the shadow side reversed? Why the shadow side reversed? Eight of Swords. The swords are defeated, disconnected, anxious.
They're gonna let you walk, but they're gonna own it. Chariot reverse, they're gonna let the chariot stop. They're not gonna let this move forward. Seven of Swords reversed. They're gonna let you walk. Five of Wands, Empress reversed. This is gonna cause a conflict. They're going to let you walk before, before an honest conversation causes conflict. They don't want conflict. Why the Five of Cups is the outcome? Oh my gosh, this is a card salad. Nine of Wands. Cutting off communication. Walls going up. Working on their healing, moving forward. Two of Pentacles reversed. They don't want any juggling. They don't want any indecisiveness. This is like if it's going to move, if it's going to move. If it's not, it's not. They may feel like they're not good enough for you. Yeah. Yeah. King of Pentacles, King of Swords, Eight of, Cup, Eight of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles reversed, Knight of Swords reversed, Two of Wands, yeah. Oh gosh, Emperor Upright. Queen, yes. They feel like they're not good enough for you. Wow. All I have to say to that is wow. As much, but here's the thing: if they keep ignoring your cup and friend zoning you. You're just gonna walk because it's gonna eventually cause a conflict. They keep rejecting your cup. The world, it's gonna end. Death, it's gonna end. Wow, okay. Let's get a wisdom for Libra. Let's get a wisdom for Libra. Oh dang. Um TikTok was on top. Let's get a Let's get a monology. Look at the bigger picture, full moon in Sagittarius. Okay. I mean, that's sound advice, right? Okay. I gotta find my books. I was so not ready for this, I apologize. Spontaneous reads. Okay. Tick tock. Number 30, tick tock. relationship message love fulfillment of desire and even the body's reproductive cycles have their own timetable some things are preordained and cannot be coerced everything has its season its divine and appropriate timing especially when it comes to matters of the heart remember that you'll always have enough time to, for love to find it to nurture it to give it and receive it its clock is eternal and takes according to the beating of your heart in perfect rhythm. Isn't that wonderful to know 
Love is always right on time. Okay, well. Maybe it's not time yet. I don't know. I'm not you. Look at the bigger picture. Full moon in Sagittarius. Are you thinking too much about the details of your dilemma? Fretting over... Minute, I can't pronounce that, can be counterproductive. Or perhaps you're being all talk and no action. This card is a reminder that it's good to think things through. Sometimes you need to step back and look at the bigger picture. What do you then see about your current situation? What's most po what's the most positive thought you can have about it? Now is the time to count your blessings, even if you don't yet uh, don't yet have exactly what you want. This card is also a reminder that we often have to take a few risks and go with uncertainty on this journey called life. Try to keep an open mind about what's for the best. The universe could surprise you. All right. All right, Libra. Thanks for coming down and hanging out. It's not quite tipped up enough. Um, this has been your January round two. <laughs> Let me know if it resonates. I do have comments open. So as long as people aren't being jerks, I'll leave them open. And we're going to see how the second job thing goes, so, but, Fire Sign Tarot will remain alive and well, I just want to assure everybody of that. I'm going to keep uploading, I'm going to keep posting, I'm going to keep reading cards, and I'm going to keep fulfilling my soul's purpose, so, peace, love, and light, and I'll catch you guys next time.